with Make It Sunderland. Over 100 exciting software jobs on offer at their jobs fairs in April. First for Wearside News, I'm Tristan Hunkin. A Sunderland dad of two will be laid to rest later as mourners gather to pray for Tipu Sultan at his funeral. Family and friends of the 32-year-old who was gunned down in a South Shields back lane are meeting at the Bangladeshi Community Centre in Hendon this afternoon. He was shot dead behind his family takeaway, Herbs and Spice Kitchen, in South Shields just over two weeks ago. Detectives are continuing to hunt his killer. A Sunderland housing firm is leading the way when it comes to making what's best for business best for the rest of us too. The Corporate Responsibility Index awarded Gen 2 Group full marks and it was the only organisation in the country to be given five stars for its work. That doesn't mean there isn't room for improvement, according to Chief Exec Peter Walls. Now, fresh from being crowned, Miss Sunderland, Sun FM speaks to local girl Hannah Rose about her triumph. She shone out from other contestants in her recycled dress made from crisp packets and plastic carrier bags. You can see the whole interview with the new Miss Sunderland on our YouTube channel. You can also get all the latest breaking news from Wearside right here at sun-fm.com. With Make It Sunderland, over 100 exciting software jobs on offer at their jobs fairs in April.